Hey guys, it's me Kayla and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be letting my hot pink lip balms decide what I eat for 24 hours. I am beyond thrilled to be doing this guys. Pink is actually my favorite color, so I am wearing my hot pink shirt. I have some hot pink going on with my nails of the week. I tried to incorporate it with like Halloween too, so we have hot pink and then like a black nail and one with a spider web so I tried getting all fancy um, but I also have a pink scrunchie on so I am so ready to film this and I want you guys to comment below and let me know if pink is one of your favorite colors too because it is definitely mine also if you guys didn't know this already I have been doing post notification shout outs so this week's shout out goes to avocado girl thank you so much for subscribing and turning on post notifications you are awesome and if you guys would like the opportunity to get a shout out in my next video then make sure you comment below hashtag notification squad and tap that little bell icon that way you're always notified whenever I upload a brand new awesome video like this one but anyways guys we are not going to waste any more time and we are going to let my hot pink lip balms decide what I eat for breakfast this morning I hope you guys enjoy watching let's get into it there are quite a few hot pink lip balms and these aren't even all my pink ones I have even more behind me those are light pink that's for another day we're focusing on hot pink today so let's choose our very first culprit okay I think we're gonna go for you <gasps> Ooh, okay it's a lip zest <gasps> and the flavor is bubblegum donuts oh that is going to be a fun thing to eat for breakfast and actually People eat donuts for breakfast. It's a very common breakfast food. It's not like the healthiest, but it's a fun breakfast. Oh no, my nail. Oh no, I smeared it. I'm definitely not sad about having this for breakfast. I have to sniff it. Oh my gosh. I came out with this lip zest flavor for Easter and I feel like I just need to re-release it at some point because it is so, so, so good. I think we should pick out maybe one more thing. Um, I'm not going to go too crazy with breakfast because I'm not a huge breakfast eater. Um, but I think maybe one more thing should be enough. So let's see what we get. And if it looks like I am picking out my lip balms in an awkward manner, like with my hand flat like this, it's because I literally just put this pink nail polish on before filming. So anyway, all right. <laughs> Let's see. How about we go for you? What is this? Okay, so I got Fruit Punch. Guys, I know I say this all the time, but I swear I pick Fruit Punch in almost every single one of these videos where my lip balm decides what I eat. Not even kidding. Like, it's just a thing. So, we're going to be having some Fruit Punch and also a bubblegum donut for breakfast. This sounds actually not too terrible. I feel like it's actually going to be decently good. So, let's go to the store and get these two items. Yes. So here's our super fun filled breakfast this morning. We have our bubblegum donut. Now I'm not gonna lie, this isn't actually a bubblegum donut. I really don't even know if those exist. However, I got some hot pink bubblegum looking frosting and put some sprinkles. It pretty much matches the little graphic on the lip balm tube, so I am very satisfied, close enough. And then we have our glass of fruit punch. So this actually doesn't seem too bad. Let's see, this donut looks really, really, really scrumptious. All right, so I usually don't start off with drinks, but I am really, really thirsty this morning. So we are going to put on the fruit punch chapstick lip balm first, okay? Mm, that smells really good. This smells like candy fruit punch, not like natural fruit punch. It smells like really sweet, but it's still super good. <sighs> I could smell that all day long. Okay, let's drink our fruit punch. Ah, fruity. Fruity as can be. Now for our bubblegum donuts. Yay! I wish I would have taken a selfie with this thing before eating it. Oh, well, it just looks so artsy. So... Mmm, let's put on the bubblegum donut lip zest lip balm. Comment below if you think that I should re-release this flavor. Like I said in the beginning of this video, I came out with this one for Easter, but I think I should re-release it again. It smells so good. It smells like bubblegum and like a donut. It's insane. So I'm going to put this on now. The combo of the fruit punch lip balm with this bubblegum donut lip balm goes really well together. I didn't think it would, but it actually does. Oh my gosh, that's sweet. Best donut 
I've had in a really long time. I'm definitely going to be devouring this entire thing. I just don't want to eat it all on camera because it would get kind of awkward just like me sitting here chomping away. That's why I never do mukbangs. But anyways, guys, that was breakfast. It was pretty simple, but if I had to rate it, I think I would give it an 8 out of 10. It was actually one of the better ones I've had. So I will see you guys later for lunchtime. What is up, guys? Now it is time for me to eat lunch. So I have our bin of hot pink lip balms right here. So the first thing we'll be having for lunch is... A cherry pop-tart I actually don't think I've ever had a cherry pop-tart before like maybe I have but it was a really 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 long time ago because I don't even remember what these taste like but this looks really good just from the picture I think I'll probably like it so we got cherry pop-tarts for lunch and obviously that is not going to be enough so let's pick something else out we got Hershey Kisses. Okay, this is just the regular Hershey's Kiss lip balm. Okay, um, I always eat so much sugar when I do these videos. Like, it's kind of nasty, actually. But, oh well. I mean, it could be worse, right? So, alright, we are going to have chocolate and Pop-Tart so far for lunch. And let's pick out one more thing, okay? Here we go. I hope I get some kind of fruit to kind of balance this out. You know what I'm saying? Um, okay, so I think I have to pick again. This literally just says lip balm, premium quality. It does not have any flavor at all. So, eh, fail. Let's try that again. Okay, we're going to go for this one. Oh my gosh, it's so tiny. Okay, so we got a watermelon flavored lip balm. It's so little and cute. All right, that's awesome. I was actually just saying that I hope I get some type of fruity lip balm, and I did. Yes, awesome. So we're going to be having some cherry Pop-Tarts, some Hershey Kisses, and some watermelon to balance it all out, all right? So I'm going to go to the store now and get this stuff, and then we're going to eat our lunch together. Ta-da! We're having another little picnic in my room because I was actually just doing some editing on my laptop. Um, but we're taking a little lunch break, okay? I am just dying to bite into this watermelon. But we gotta put the little baby watermelon lip balm on first. So, I think you push this up to get the product. Yeah, that is so neat, oh my gosh. And it actually smells just like fresh watermelon. That's actually insane. Mmm. Wow, how do you get it back down? Just push it down? Yeah, okay, cool. I remember one time I was in a public restroom and they had a little machine that sold these in the bathroom. Can you believe it? Yeah, I'm so excited. This thing is so cold and juicy. Here we go. Mm, it's so sweet too. I feel like I really don't even need a drink now because this is so juicy and watermelony. I'm going to try these cherry Pop-Tarts. So here's the cherry Pop-Tart lip balm. And like I mentioned, I don't know if I've ever tried cherry Pop-Tarts before. And if I did, it's been a really, really, really long time. I don't even remember if I like them or not. So this smells like a cardboard box. It's clearly expired, but it's okay, whatever. That is pigmented. Well, that watermelon has a strange aftertaste. Okay, so here it is out of the package. It's like pink frosting with red sprinkles. Let's break it in half. And I'm just going to eat it fresh from the package. I'm not going to freeze it or put it in the toaster or anything. We're just going to have a solid Pop-Tart just in the normal way. It's kind of sour. So the taste of that reminds me a lot of cherry pie because the filling tastes just like the filling of cherry pie and the outside kind of resembles the crust of a cherry pie. So it actually was pretty good. I think it would be better in the toaster, but I'm going to give that a thumbs up. So anyways, to conclude our lunch, we are going to be having some Hershey's Kisses. So my mouth still tastes really, really sweet from that Pop-Tart. Um, I don't think I'm going to have too many, but okay, this lip balm is brown. Let's see how pigmented it is on the back of my hand first. Eh, there's just a little bit of color payoff, but not really. This still smells really good. Okay, it tastes so sweet, like really sweet. Let's eat one of these little cuties. When I was younger, I was always so mesmerized by the fact that like if you pull the top, it just opens it up like boom. It's like magic, okay? Mm -hmm. These 
are bomb. My favorite thing was definitely the watermelon from this lunch. Wait, I'm trying to like break it into a smaller piece without getting a knife. Without getting a knife. Oh, oh there's pieces of watermelon on my carpet now. Hashtag fail. Anyways, guys, before this gets any messier, I'm going to end this clip here and I'm going to finish my lunch off camera, but I will see you guys later on for dinner time. I can't wait. Hey guys, I am back right in time for dinner. I am so excited to see what we are going to be having tonight. This video has been so much fun to film and I don't want it to end. Like, I really love eating pink sugary foods all day. Not gonna lie, it's been awesome. So, all right, we got our bin of lip balms right here though and let's see what we get. So I think we're gonna go for the back this time, okay? Now let's dig deep, okay? Ooh, baby. What are we going to have for dinner? This is a pretty big one. Let's see, it is. Oh my gosh! Yes, guys! Oh my god. I am legit so excited right now. So I got birthday cake ice cream. And if you didn't know this, birthday cake ice cream is actually my favorite thing ever to exist on planet Earth. And I've been looking for a valid excuse to go eat it, okay? Um, yes, please. So we're going to be having that. And now let's pick again, my friends. Okay, let's do this one. All right, so I got this unicorn lip balm with like a hot pink mane. And I think for this one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some pink unicorn pudding because it's unicorn themed, duh, and it's pink. So we're gonna be having some birthday cake ice cream, some pink unicorn pudding. Girl, so many sweets, ah! That's what's so fun about these videos though. So moving right along. And I got the pick again. Maybe we'll get some kind of fruit this time to balance things out, kind of like lunch. I don't know, we'll see. I got, oh, this lip balm has a big old thing of cotton candy. And let's see, yep, Clancy's cotton candy is the flavor. So we're gonna get some pink cotton candy. Ah, this is so much sugar. Like, I'm excited, but girl, so much sugar. Pink pudding, birthday cake ice cream, and cotton candy. I'm gonna be in like a sugar coma. Um, maybe I should stop there. I, I think I probably should because seriously, I was going to pick four things out, but that is a lot of sugar. And with my luck, I'll probably end up getting something sugary again and I will get sick. So I don't want that to happen. Usually when I have birthday cake ice cream, it fills me up quite a bit too. And I'm going to be going to my favorite ice cream place, Brewster's, to get it. So, okay, for our dinner, once again, we're gonna be having birthday cake ice cream, my favorite thing ever, um, some pink unicorn pudding, and some pink cotton candy. What fun this video has been. I can't wait to go get this stuff for dinner. So let's go, my friends, let's go get it. Hey guys, so as you can tell, I'm actually in my car right now, and I am parked at Brewster's. If you don't know what Brewster's is, it's an ice cream place. They have the best ice cream ever, um, and also I apologize for the crappy lighting. It is currently 6.13 p.m., so it is around dinner time, and what I decided to do is eat dinner in my car, and I'm going to start off with eating our cotton candy and our unicorn pudding, and then I'm going to go get my birthday cake ice cream, because if if I get it right now, then it'll just be hard to like eat everything and it'll be messy. I even brought a spoon. I came prepared. The first thing I am going to eat is the pink unicorn pudding. Um, these pudding cups come in the colors pink and blue, but of course I had to go with pink because of the theme of this video. So here is the unicorn lip balm right here. Um, the product is like in its neck. That sounds really creepy, but it's true. So it's like clear kind of smells like cherry that might actually be its flavor I'm not sure though um yeah it's not really labeled anywhere on the lip balm but that's okay let's just open this up oh this is literally the best pudding ever it tastes like cotton candy and bubble gum it's amazing mmm so good studio lights I actually think that made the lighting worse but okay I don't know if that made it worse or better, but I just put my car lights on. Next up, we are going to be eating our cotton candy. So this is our Clancy's Cotton Candy Lip Smacker. Mmm. 
this still smells like cotton candy it's starting to smell kind of older but that's okay it still works it still smells pretty good all right there we go i just had to do that little lip smack sorry it is a lip smacker get it <laughs> anyway so here is our cotton candy and it's all pink i'm just realizing that it's actually cherry flavored i got this at target and the reason i wanted to get this kind was because it was all pink and i went to the dollar store beforehand but i only saw like the multicolored cotton candy so this is all pink though let's see if it actually tastes like cherry ready here we go Mm. I think it just tastes like regular cotton candy, but that's quite all right. It's still really good. It looks so satisfying. But all right, guys. So now I'm going to go get in line at Brewster's and order myself some birthday cake ice cream. I'm so excited, guys. I'm going to put it on right now so that when I come in the car, I can just eat the ice cream right away because I won't have any self-control and I don't want it to melt. So here we go. Oh, my gosh. That smells like an old attic. It's definitely expired. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's crazy. That's okay. I'm still gonna put it on. It's the fun factor that I like. Okay, so it's on. It's weird. It smells so old, but it still tastes sweet. Unless that's like the taste of the cotton candy I'm tasting. I don't know. Anyways, guys, I'm going to get in line and get my birthday cake ice cream, and I will be right back. The next time you see me, I'm going to have an ice cream cone in my hand. Ready? It's going to be magic. I'm going to have ice cream. Ready? One, two, three. Whoa, how'd this get here? <laughs> okay, that was being dramatic. But, all right, it's already starting to melt on me, so I'm very happy that I put that lip balm on beforehand. Mmm. This is so good. It's literally my favorite food. Mm! I asked for extra rainbow sprinkles. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to finish this ice cream cone off camera because I'm sure you guys don't want to sit here and watch me eat an entire ice cream cone in my car. So that was all for our amazing dinner. All right, you guys. So that was all for today's video of my hot pink lip balms deciding what I eat for the day. If you like this video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and also make sure you click subscribe and turn on post notifications if you have not done so already. The question of the day is, how many pink emojis can you comment below in just 10 seconds? Ready? Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, I can't wait to see how you guys did. Anyways, guys, thank you again for watching. I love you all so, so much, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye! Mwah.